Good morning, YouTube. It is now 11 o'clock a.m. Good morning, guys. First of all, let me just start off by saying how wonderful Microsoft is. So Microsoft has made an adapter for the disabled. And it doesn't look anything, um, it doesn't look anything negative or out of, it's just like a regular Xbox product. It's like an 11 inch, uh, 11 inch long, 6 inch wide adapter piece. You have all these buttons on the remote and all these buttons are on the back of the adapter and it's like 19 of them for them to plug in their own kind of, uh, um, their own kind of, um, accessories for that they would love for that they would love to have for their buttons. So on this adapter, they have 19 3.5 millimeter jacks on the back, and this is for the different controller button. And all these buttons are on the back of the adapter, and it's like 19 of them for them to plug in their own kind of, uh, um, their own kind of um, accessories for that they would love for, that they would love to have for their buttons. On each side of the adapter, it has two USB ports on each side of it. It's wireless, and it's Bluetooth. So you get no plugs or nothing, and you only have the charger that goes with it. And I think the charger holds like 25 hours of gaming. It hooks up to the Xbox like any other controller will. And on the back of it, there's three different mount options that you can use to mount up for the that you can set up to your preference of gaming. But like I said, the product is not like for the disabled. It's it's kind of like like a regular Xbox product and they actually made like this on purpose so it wouldn't look negative or stand out in a negative way. This product is is slimmer on the front and it's like a ridge on the back so you could like so you can sit it up and you can pressure the way you want to pressure anything or you can have it sitting on your lap. This product will not be available until the middle of the year and it'll run for a hundred dollars. Maybe more, maybe less, but it's somewhere in that price range of a hundred dollars and it's affordable. It's for it brings gaming to everybody, not just one per, not just one set of people. It brings equality in the gaming community, so anybody can game now. And it's it's not like for disabled. It's more lines of it, it doesn't look like for disabled. It's more lines of regular Xbox. So you know it won't stand out. I think that's pretty good. And I think Microsoft stepped the game up when they did that. And you know this could change a lot. I think Microsoft is owning something.